fill the Spirit of God. Amen. And, uh, you know, I have family. I told Sister Molly that. And I, have and I love my family. My family loves me. But also I have the family of God. Amen. Amen. You know, uh, uh, to my children, you are my children's aunts and uncles and grandpas and grandmothers and, right. and brothers and sisters. We say brother and sister because there's a, a connection because we are brothers. We are sisters yeah. one another yeah. um, because of that love and that bond that the Lord has put there yeah. in our lives. I like, to, I like to think that sometimes I look at things a little differently. In, a, in the Bible, it talks about a, a lame man had an infirmity, and he heard a noise among the crowd. Yes. Jesus was coming down the road. Yes. And he cried out, Jesus, yes. thou son of David, have mercy upon me. He was where the Lord was coming. And the Lord, had, Jesus had mercy on him, and he healed his infirmity right there. But I also like to think, what about everybody else that was there? Yes. That had an infirmity, or had a need, or just needed to fill the Spirit of the Lord. I wonder how many of them would have cried out, Oh, Jesus, thou Son of David, have mercy upon me. As Sister Marlowe in the praise team was singing that song, Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. I was reaching out, I could feel my Holy Ghost. In the service, I could feel the Spirit of God. And you know, it's no different today than what it was when Jesus was walking down that road. When that man needed to feel a healing. It's no different today. There's many people that's here in this building. And I don't know how many infirmities there may be. I don't know how many people that just may need to feel that good old-fashioned Spirit of God, Holy Ghost. But the Lord knows. And I believe He's walking down the aisles of this church. I believe His Spirit is walking right down these aisles, going to and from us, just waiting for somebody to call upon Him. Because we have a good God, like Sister Nani was saying. If we could just call upon God, He is big enough to do anything that we have need of tonight. It don't matter what your need is. You may think it's small or you may think it's big. But no matter what your need is, Jesus is here. His Spirit is here to meet your need. Whether it's a healing, whether it's nothing more than just a feel, as Brother Harris was saying. The good old Spirit of God. Oh, yes. If we can just reach our hand up and put our hand in His, be willing and obedient enough to say, Oh God, I love you. And Lord, I need you. I need to feel your Spirit. I need to feel your hand upon my life. If you'll just reach out to Him, He'll reach out to you. And he is big enough to do whatever we have need of in our life. How do I know? Because he's here for me. He has mercy upon me. And I certainly don't deserve his mercy. But he has mercy upon me. And he loves me because, you know what? He allowed you to call me brother. And he allowed me to call you sister. So if you need the Lord tonight, call upon the Lord. He's right here. No matter what you need is great or small, you call upon the Lord and he will. Meet your name.